All right, so now we are all done creating your website for free on tyler.com, but you probably don't want it to keep it on tyler.com forward slash your name because that doesn't look very professional. You probably want your own website name, your own domain name. So if we go to tyler.com, we can see the first step was to create your website. You're done with that. The second step is to get your domain name and hosting. We're about to do that. And then we're going to transfer it over to your own website. So we're going to transfer this website that you just made to your real website. All right, so let's go ahead and do that. So we're going to do step two. We're going to get your domain name and hosting. And we're going to do that at hostgator.com. That's H-O-S-T-G-A-T-O-R dot C-O-M. So we're on HostGator.com and you want to click on web hosting. You don't want cloud hosting or WordPress hosting or any of these other things because they just cost more money and you can always upgrade later and it doesn't work you know, perfectly with my tutorials. So you want to do web hosting and we want to um, do the hatchling plan. The business plan is way too much because we can always upgrade later for free. Um, we're not going to do that. The difference between the hatching plan and the baby plan is the hatching plan has a single domain name. So like yourwebsite.com, where the baby plan has unlimited domain names. So it could be yourwebsite.com, <clears throat> your mom's website.com, your friend's website.com. Um, you can have a whole bunch. I personally have the baby plan, but why would you ever want to start off with something that's more expensive? So always just do the least expensive. And once you start getting traffic, then you can um, upgrade. Once people start going to your website, then you can upgrade. So we're going to press sign up now. And then it's going to ask us our domain name. So um, this is our website name. Um, you can press, I already have a domain name if you got it from somewhere like GoDaddy, or you can register a new domain name. And um, there are lots and lots of hosting companies out there, but I like HostGator the best. Um, there are probably thousands of them, and some are good, some are bad. Um, HostGator I've been with for like 10 years, so I really like them. All right, so we're going to enter in your domain name. I'm going to do I'm already here.com. And you can choose the .com, and then it's going to search, and it's going to say, okay, this one is available. And to choose a domain name, it's probably just like your business name. Um, or it can be something like if you're selling shoes in Los Angeles, it could be, you know, Los Angeles designer shoes .com. Something with the keywords in it so that you search, uh, you um, rank well in the search engines. But usually it's just your business name and that's the best thing to go with. All right, you don't need the .club, .site, .net, blah, 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 blah. You also don't need domain privacy. <clears throat> um, what that does is someone can look up your domain name and they can see your address and, and phone number on the internet. Some people don't like that and some people do like that. Um, I, I think it's fine, I trust people, so I'm gonna uncheck that and you can always add it later. All right, so it's gonna say, what plan do you wanna go with? Do you wanna go with the hatching plan? Yes. And what's the billing cycle? Do you want to pay 36 months at a time? And if you do, you get a bigger discount. Or do you want to just go one month at a time? And if you do, you, you get a smaller discount. Um, so the higher up months you go, the uh, bigger discount you get. But we're just going to go month to month for this one. And we're going to enter in our username. All right, and then our pin. And enter in your billing information and credit card, and uh, or you can use PayPal. Then it's gonna try to add on these uh, additional services. You can add them, but you can always add them later. So we're gonna uncheck these, and then it's gonna say, okay, now it's twenty three dollars and ninety cents with this coupon code. But I have a better coupon code. It's actually the highest coupon code that you can get. Um, and it is together, T-O-G-E-T-H-E-R, and press validate. And now it goes down to $10, but then it switches to 13, and that's because when you enter it up, it adds this again. So you want to check that off, and then it'll go back to down to $10. And I think 
for ten dollars to get your domain name to get your um hosting uh and to basically launch a business online i think that's a huge 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 uh value so um i do get credit uh when you enter in this together um, but it is the biggest discount ever so it's a win-win situation i'm able to make websites like tyler.com and give out all this free information when you guys enter in this um, coupon code so i really appreciate it all right once you do that click i have read and agreed to the terms of service and click check out now and once you do that it's going to give you a congratulations page and that's when you know it's time to go ahead and check your email so i'm just going to go to my email which is gmail.com